Hi, Sean. I'm excited to meet you again. The last time I saw you was at the Ice Age premiere. I was just wondering, are there any more opportunities for you since Ice Age of doing that picture-in-picture -picture signing for programs? Well, there are more opportunities coming up. Uh, but not so much with the picture in picture. I'm just going with the flow in, in terms of my career. And right now, I'm just focused on this show. Uh, this is my number one priority. And uh, also, uh, I have had the opportunity to represent the deaf community here. Cool. I was wondering what kind of music you like. Do you write music videos or songs or anything? Well, I don't write songs. Uh, I am profoundly deaf. How can I write songs? But I can write poems. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I, I, I write the script uh, for the music video uh, that we produce for the music videos. Uh, there are some other film projects that I'm working on writing uh, right now, and that's pretty much what I'm doing currently. <laughs> so are you thinking of starting your own production company, for example? Well, I already have my own production company and uh, entertainment company. Uh, that is Sean Birdie Entertainment. You know, I'm here in the library and I see uh, information on the walls about Gallaudet and Laurent Claire and all of that. And that's, that's interesting. It's my first experience seeing deaf-related material on a Hollywood set. Working here on the set, how do you feel uh, seeing all the deaf ephemera and all the uh, cultural uh, context that they have? That's a very unique show. Uh, you know, it is a blessing to have ABC Family look out for the deaf community and, and in fact, to make the show. Uh, not only that, the cast makes a huge difference because everybody in the cast is becoming, mm -hmm. uh, you know, fluent in sign language. And because all I've been, you know, doing is signing. And so I know sign language pretty okay now, uh, but my Italian has suffered for it. <laughs> that makes this production a beautiful show. Not only that, the deaf audience can enjoy the show as well because there are authentic moments. Well, that's great because Liz or Lizzie, she, she writes the scripts. Did she ever talk with you about ideas? I mean, she's not from the deaf community. Well, you know, this story originally uh, had a uh, ASL consultant uh, help Lizzie develop uh, context. Yeah, I've learned. Uh, I've learned a whole bunch. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, I I started um, at the beginning uh, with Katie. Three years later. I've learned a lot, so it's cool. And Especially when we're doing scenes and I have to uh, sign as well, you know, as as well as talk. Um, it just kind of puts things into a simpler per perspective sometimes, and it helps me. It actually helps. Uh, it helps learning the lines sometimes because uh, having a sign uh, along with the word is kind of like choreography, like when I dance.